Hello there. Um, I am back with a, another shocker K-pop haul. So I've got some photo card trades slash purchases. I've got an album. I've got obviously this going on over here. Anyways, let's get started. Let's jump into, so I've already purchased these. I haven't opened them up yet. I'm gonna do those, I think at the end. And then I have, I'm gonna start with this little one. Okay, so this I bought off of Mercari. I've already opened or just like cut things open just to make it like easier on myself. So I'm not just sitting around cutting the whole time, but I'm gonna open this up. Ah, yep. Yeah. This is a Flavors of Love CD. And this Mercari seller was letting you pick which photo card you wanted. So obviously I picked Juhani. Um, oh, and she included some cute stuff. Oh, how cute. Some cute stickers, a little honeybee that's very cute and on brand. Um, and yeah, so this is definitely these. This photo card is much smaller than like the standard um, photo card. I just adore the Flavors of Love song and music video so much. I feel like it's not as popular, maybe. Um, and then here's the Flavors of Love album. Oh, this is like, is it sealed? Oh, it's like not quite sealed. Oh, I didn't even see this. Another little freebie. Oh, look at my cute Johnny and Wano. I still, it's because I'm, you know, I became a, Wano, or a Monster X fan this past year. I'm still like surprised when I see like Wano stuff come through, but there's still such a big like Wano following out there for sure. Um, so here is the CD got a little track list over here on the side. Um, I think I've already listened to all of this, I'm pretty sure. I don't know. I mean, I prefer their stuff in Korean, but it's Monster X, so I like it all. What am I saying? I like it all. Let's do a quick run through. I mean, this came out a while ago, so I'm sure people have seen this. Um, cute, them sitting at the diner. And then a track list. Oh, it looks like we've got lyrics in here. That's cool for each song. I didn't know if maybe, I haven't seen it like an unboxing of this. I didn't know if maybe it came with any photos. It looks like there's very few photos in here. We've got Shoki, we've got Minyuk and Hungwon, and then we've got the rapper line. So cute. Oh, they're just so adorable. I loved the shots um, from the music video of them in this like room with like little notes from Mom Bebe. So cute. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to add this to my Monster X collection and I'm particularly excited. I mean, this was like the main reason I wanted to buy this. I saw some photo cards selling like on their own, um, but I was like, you know, I'd like to have this album too, just so I could see. Cause I, again, I thought maybe there were gonna be more pictures in here, but anyways, I'm pleased with that photo card and I'm happy to get that. Um, yeah, and then all these cute little freebies are so sweet. Okay, next up I have a package from, let me see how I'm gonna open this. This is something from Etsy, I think. Oh, I think I know what this is. Okay, so I had purchased some BTS and Monsta X washi tape from an Etsy seller recently, and they sent me the wrong Monsta X. Yeah, that's what this is, this is a washi tape. They sent me the wrong Monsta X washi tape and I reached out to them and they were like oh my gosh we're so sorry so they sent me the correct one so I got this I don't know if you can see it so well it is tiny little images of the band members so you've got Shonu, Wano, Kian, Hungwon, Juhani, I am did I miss anybody they should all be there <laughs> um yeah super cute I wanted to get some Monster X washi tape because I have BTS washi tape already I actually let me see this is yeah here, I have it already this is the months or this is the BTS washi tape that I bought from this Etsy seller. I'll I'll put their like shop name in the bottom. How cute is this stuff? It's BTS quotes. Like, oh my friends, BTS. You know BTS? Pardon? And my ultimate favorite. Oh, okay, no, this is my second favorite quote from BTS is Jimin, you got no jams. <laughs> oh my god. It is so funny to me. Um, so yeah, this is like super cute. And I think that like diehard BTS lovers will like get all of these, um, those quotes. But yeah, so I'm excited to get this. Ugh, I can't like get it open. This uh, Monster X little faces, little emojis. So it's like silly pictures of them. Uh, 
I'm just trying to get it unwrapped so we can like see it. It's kind of like a weird brown color, honestly. I thought it was like a maybe more of a beige. Well, I guess it's like a gray. Um, so yeah, there we go. Can you see it? Is my camera focusing? Um, yeah, I'm excited to have some Monsta X washi tape because I, most of my trades, I mean, my, I'm mostly, even though BTS is my ult, I'm mostly collecting, um, Monsta X. That's just like what I decided that I wanted for my collection. And then, um, this essay seller included some little freebies, cute little picture. Oh my God. I love this sticker. What a cool Monsta X sticker. Oh my gosh. I really like that a lot. That's cute. Um, just some fun little stuff in here. Oh, and a BTS. Oh, so cute. Oh my, oh my God. Look at this photo. Wow. That's a cute picture. Um, so yeah, anyways, that's really cute. I'm glad to have those washi tapes. Um, okay. Next up, I need to like tidy up as I go. Okay. Next up. Okay. Let's do the Funko Pops now. Um, so I was at, I don't know, some like resale store near me fifth and main or honestly like i don't even know like what it's called and i asked them if they had a k-pop i've never been in there before i asked them if they had a k-pop section and um the woman who was working there said no we don't really sell k-pop stuff but i do have the funko pops um for bts and i got really excited and they only had one rm which i got they had like two gin and then they had like a thousand v left i was thinking that's weird where all the V fans. Um, so yeah. Oh, so cute. <laughs> I have a little small collection of Harry Potter Funko Pops. And so I thought these would just be a cute little kind of like addition to my Funko Pop collection. Like a very small, I don't go crazy with Funko Pops, honestly. Um, it's just, I just don't, I don't know. I've never found a way that I like necessarily to like display them. I just like to kind of, oh my God, I, I know this is like so silly, but I absolutely love the blue hair. Oh my gosh. I mean, RM was just looking so cute for all the dynamite, everything. Um, I just love the bright cotton candy blue hair. Oh my gosh. I really like these. So anyways, yeah. So I picked up these two and um, I, when I got home, I don't know if they're easy to find right now. I'm not sure. So I placed an order for Jungkook on Amazon because I am a fool. I had totally said I was not buying these. And then I saw them and then I bought them. I mostly bought them, honestly. So RM is like my third favorite character. <laughs> I don't know. I keep like referring to them as characters um, in BTS. But this one I just like wanted like so, 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 so much. Like I had a feeling I was going to buy this one no matter what. And then I just felt like I didn't want him to be lonely. So I got his little buddy Jin too. Who's, I mean, Jin's my bias wrecker. And then... I can't have RM and Jin and not have Jungkook. Hello. Um, the back of the boxes, I didn't even show the boxes. They just have like their images on the side. And then the back just have like the different options that you can get. So Jungkook, they're all in this outfits that are like from the music video. Um, I'm so tempted to get J-Hope. I feel, so I decided I cannot collect too many BTS members because it is too expensive already. Mostly because Jungkook. People who sell Jungkook stuff are crazy, and they overprice him, and it's annoying. Um, but I can't collect too many of them, but I keep getting this itch to collect J-Hope. Bear with me, you guys. Like, please keep me in your thoughts. No, I'm just kidding. I can't afford to collect all of to, to collect four. But J-Hope is, like, I keep seeing J-Hope cards that I really want to get. Um, okay, so what do we have here? <gasps> cuteness oh my god oh my god so I this is here's another great example I swore I was not going to collect the Joker Jahani I was like I mm, uh, so I don't know if I said this before maybe I've said this on one of my other videos the first time I watched Love Killa music video two things and this is shocking to me now but two things. One was I didn't like the song. <laughs> and two, I did not find Juhani attractive at all in the slightest in this Joker look. I was like, what is happening here? 
what is going on here? I like, I just would. <laughs> Uh, so the reason this is so funny to me is because uh, if you know me, I'm like stupid crushing on Juhani all of the time. I love Juhani. He's my bias. I'm just obsessed with him. He's like my main um, <laughs> character that I collect. And I absolutely love love Killa. The music video, the song, I love it. The dance, I freaking love it. I feel like I really liked um, Monster X because of their All About Love album. The first Monster X song I ever heard was um, Middle of the Night, which is still hands down my favorite song of theirs. But I like became a fan. I like started to stand them, if you will, because of Love Killa. And so it's funny to me that I was like, ugh, to all of it, to just all of it. Now I'm like, Oh my god, I saw this card. I was like, I have to get this flipping card. So anyways, yeah, long story for a freaking photo card. I had to get the Joker Johanny. There's another version of the Joker Johanny floating around out there, I think, where maybe he's making, like, heart with his hands, maybe. I'll probably have to get that one too now. I've just, like, I, I gotta, I have to, like, keep saying, like, I got, I can't listen to myself. I'm like, stop listening to myself because I keep saying things like, oh, I'm not gonna buy that. I don't want that. I'm not interested or whatever. Oh my god, I'm cute little Uno cards. <laughs> I actually have um, a Uno set from BTS. I got it for Christmas from my manager at work. It was so nice for her to get that for me. Um, and the cards are huge. They're bigger than like this greeting card. It's so big. It's nuts. Um, oh, how cute. Oh, yes, this is like the last message card that I needed for Fatal Love was um, Shonu. So I, this is a trade I traded. I think I had, I think I sent my, I had duplicates of lenticular cards for like Keon and um, I love this washi tape. It's so cute for Keon and Minyuk and I traded, I don't remember which one. I traded one of them for this one though. Um, yeah, original, again, listen to me. Originally I thought, oh, I don't know. I'm not super wild about this picture necessarily. Um, so I wasn't really planning on collecting. I was going to go out of my way to collect it, but then somebody like DM'd me and wanted to trade. And I thought, you know what? Yeah. Yeah. Why not? Let's do it. Let's trade. So I'm so happy to finish out my Fatal Love message cards. I just think I like Fatal Love era. I think that that's like my jam. I think that's my favorite era for them. Honestly, I feel like I said that about one of a kind the other day. So cute. So it's like little freebies. Um, this person included uh, some Uno cards. That's cute. Oh my God, Jungkook. <laughs> this picture of RM I see every so often. It just makes me laugh because it's just so like not his personality. It's such a funny photo. And there's J-Hope. Look, J-Hope's like, oh, were you talking about me? Were you thinking about collecting me? Uh, you should. That's what he's saying to me. No, I'm not going to collect J-Hope. I'm not collecting J-Hope. It's too much. I can't collect four members. I do collect four members of BTS, though. Should I collect J-Hope? If somebody comments on this video and says you should collect J-Hope, I might collect J-Hope. I'm going to strongly think about it. Okay, what do I have in here? Okay, oh yes, this is something. I know what this is. This is from eBay. Oop. This is from eBay. I believe this is a B Deluxe album. That's what it should be at least. That's what I ordered. Um, and I believe I picked, wow, there is a lot of bubble wrap. Like, thank you, eBay seller. Um, okay. <laughs> it's not wrapped, so I'm, yeah, I'm pretty sure I picked the photo card. How cute, open me. Oh, this is a cute little pack. Oh, a cute little thank you note. Oh, with some little freebies. That's cute. Let's see what we got in here. I just love these. I keep a lot of them. I use them. I put them in trades for like items I'm not as crazy about, but I keep a lot of them, honestly. And I just love stickers. Oh my goodness. It's J-Hope again. J-Hope. Stop trying to tempt me into collecting you. Jin. Ugh. Ah. Oh. How cute. <laughs> oh, I just love it. God, I'm just so... 
I'm so like pathetic when it comes to this stuff. It's just so cute. I just love it all. Okay, yeah, so this is the B. What did I say? This is B Deluxe. I have the Essential one already. And I have it. Oh, I have not seen it. Oh my god. I like almost just bent this. Okay, so I, this was the photo card that came with this one and I picked it. This whole thing I think was like 20 bucks. I said this before, I think on my last videos, when you're looking for photo cards, sometimes people attach them to the albums. I think it's because they buy too many of the albums and they just want to get the albums out of their house. So they like give a deal almost to make, to make somebody get the album out of their homes. So yeah, so I picked Jin. Um, I think they had Jin and RM options and I went with Jin and I was like eyeing the RM one, but I haven't, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, but yeah, so I'm excited to have this one. And then the small photo cards, again, I know this is out. I know everybody's seen these already, but this is my first time seeing them. I mean, I've seen an unboxing, so it's not completely true that I haven't seen them. I mean, come on, JK. What are you doing to me? How cute. Um, yeah, so I'm excited. Ooh, nice, adding a little more gin to my collection. Um, okay, and then here's the photo book. So I really liked the section of the essential version. Wait, which one is this? The other version, the one that didn't come with a photo card. Um, where they had like a section of photos that they themselves took. I don't love the black and white photos. I mean, ugh, these are, yeah, I'm not loving these black and white photos, honestly. But yeah, so the photos that they took themselves, or did, or did they take these ones maybe? No. Those are two, I don't think they took those. Um, I really liked. I'm just flipping through this quick. Just again, like I said, I know everybody has already like seen these. I mean, everybody. Even if you don't like Jimin, how could you not like these photos? Who doesn't like Jimin though? That's a joke. I think Jimin is the most likable um, character. There you go again. I think that Jimin is the most likable one in the whole band. Like I think you'd be hard pressed to find people that dislike Jimin. This, I feel like, is a very, very popular picture of him from this era. This is such a cool photo with his reflection. If I were to pick one of these rooms that, like, I would want to be, like, my room for, like, a photo shoot like this, I would have picked Jin's room. I saw this thing the other day that said, you, you like your bias. Have I already said this? You like your bias because you're like that. Like you share personality traits with your bias and that's why you like them so much. And I like thought about that. I probably spent too much time thinking about that statement because my bias is Jungkook. I don't think I'm similar to Jungkook, like at all. So I disagree, but I do, but Jin is my bias wrecker. And I do think I have a lot of personality traits similar to Jin and again, ARMS, my third favorite. I think that me personally, I have more, I have personality traits that are similar to these two, but nothing has to do with Jungkook. But also I, historically I could say, um, all the guys I've dated are not like me at all. Like I, I'm, I go for personalities that are different from mine. Um, and then here's the CD. What songs are on here? Oh, right. I like totally forgot what album this was for a second because I was just like lost in my thoughts for a minute. They don't have a track list on here. My absolute favorite song off of this album though, where's the track list? There has to be a track list in here. They can't just not have a track list. They legit do not have a track list in here. How is that possible? This is an album, you guys, hello. I like can't, oh wait, does this open? Oh, it opens, does this open? No, that is glued. Wow, I was about to like rip that open. Um, my favorite song on here is Stay. Like for sure. I love that song so much. When they performed it at the Sowuzu concert, my heart just like melted. I'm, it's not just because I know what you're thinking. It's not just because my favorite trio 
performs that song. That's not the only reason I love that song. I just like it anyways, but on, but yeah, no, that definitely contributed to my trio bias. <laughs> uh, anyways, okay, that's enough of me droning on and on about K-pop stuff. Anyways, thank you so much for joining me today with my unboxing of my recent K-pop haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, stay glamorous, stay safe, and I will catch you next time. Bye!